After a nine-day break, UMBC basketball in action against Navy at the Rack Arena. Retrievers looking to go to 4-1 and one at home on the year. They would get off to a good start. Rodney Elliott hits the opening tray of the game. That will be a sign of things to come. Retrievers get off to a quick start. Here on the fast break, Navy's Brandon Venturini goes to the basket. Has it blocked away by Devara Houston. Quentin Jones quickly up to Rodney Elliott. Elliott the end one scoring. That gives UMBC once again the early lead. Navy, however, would battle back. They would lead most of the first half. Devark Housen hits a three here. And with Navy leading by four, right at the end of the half, Malik Garner hits a big three to put UMBC only down by one point, 21-20 at the break. UMBC in the second half after Navy would tie it at 29. Charles Taylor would give UMBC the lead for good on this drive to the basket from the baseline. And then the barrage of threes would start for the Retrievers. They would hit 10 in the game. This one by Quinton Jones would give UMBC a six-point lead. Then it was Brett Roseboro. He nails the lefty tray. That was part of an 8-0 run, which Chase Plummer caps right here with a long-range three-pointer. Rodney Elliott would hit four or five from behind the arc. Here's another one. That gave UMBC a nine-point lead. Brian Harris came up big for the Retrievers. 14 points in the last nine minutes of play. Here he hits the drive and goes to the free throw line. And finally, Rodney Elliott from the top of the key. Another tray, his final one of the game. Then Elliott, a great breakdown drive to the basket here. He hits the layup. The Retrievers win this one over Navy by a score of 63-48. Well, it was clearly a good win against a good team that a couple of weeks ago, we had a not so good result, so it was good to be able to bounce back and make some adjustments. And I thought play a really good defensive game. You know, holding a team like that to 48 points that is so potent from the three-point line that it's, it's it's a tough task to do. And, and we we were up for the challenge tonight, and we took care of it, and we were able to come out on top. Um, these two young men were huge. It's good to have uh, Brian Harris in uniform, and, um, and you know we've been waiting to see what he can do out there and. That's he did what we thought he could do. Um, it felt great to be out there. Um, you know, I've been out for a long time, so my teammates just been helping me, like um, stay ready. And I, I was ready when I got in there. It was honestly from coach. He was telling me to like try to find out how I can maneuver around the defenders and not go through them and stuff. And I was honestly just trying to find my way early in the game. Yeah, it was in the flow. Guys got me the uh, ball in the right spot, and I was able to knock it down.